All right, this is an exciting game. The 49ers at 10 and 2 take on the Saints at 10 and 2. Saints are two and a half point home favorites. It's a 44 and a half point over under. This is really difficult, I think, for fantasy football players in the playoffs with Saints players because the 49ers defense is just it's stout. It's solid. Very few teams have done anything against them, and very few quarterbacks have done anything against them. Here you are with Drew Brees. Do you play all these streaming options, the Fitzpatrick, Tannehill, Darnold options over Drew Brees in playoffs week one? Oh, man, that is that is really, really tough to do, and I think I would do it. Most of, really? Most of the options out there, I would expect to have a better game than Drew Brees. Uh, you know, you, you've you've got the ability here with the Saints, to, and that's not to say Drew Brees can't get it done. He certainly, obviously, is a first ballot Hall of Fame quarterback, um, and he could get it done just by constantly targeting Michael Thomas over and over and over and over and over. Um, but they can also try to run the ball here and you know beat them a number of different ways. We have so many games for Drew Brees over the last two years, three years really, where he's not always a great fantasy player. And so well, you're look at caught two- up with the name of Drew Brees, but he he's not one of those week in and week out guys that are always good for fantasy. Let me just illustrate that point for you, Jason. Atlanta. He's played Atlanta twice. We just talked about the matchup that Atlanta is for opposing quarterbacks. He's played Atlanta two times in the last four games. He's the fantasy quarterback twenty one and the fantasy quarterback twenty seven. That's Drew Brees' games. It, you know, so like you said, there it's not the guarantee. And at home against the 49ers, I'm trying to move away. I, I'm not forcing a move away from Drew Brees at home. He's. He, I don't think he's a top fifteen guy this week. I. I. So you're willing. You're. You're willing to good make that pivot of you're going to stream Sam Darnold. You're going to stream Tannehill and Fitzpatrick over Drew Brees. I think I would do all three. Yeah, yeah. I think so. I know that's a bold statement, but I don't. San Francisco coming off a loss. I. I don't love it. Yeah, I I don't love it either, but I if I think if I have Drew Brees, I'm going to stick with him. At home this year, we, we got our smaller sample size, but we historically Drew Brees is much better at home. It's true. And this year that that weird game against Atlanta, that's his his one down game at home. Other than that, he's been he's been averaging about two and a half touchdowns a game. We've talked a lot about Josh Allen in the matchups for Josh Allen, who's been a more consistent fantasy producer. He's at home too against Baltimore. So, I think it's just what are you what do you want to go down with? Yeah, um, that's the Drew Brees question is a very tough one this week. Thank you so much for watching that video. It would make me so happy if you watched more of those videos. So click subscribe, ring that bell, and make your life a little better today.